Hey, it's Bruce. PetTurkeys.com? Look what I just found in a, in a, a pile of junk. It's my old turkey box call from high school. That was last century, by the way. So, on my pets, on my pet turkey site, I have a, I have a page on turkey calls, turkey language, turkey communication. And it was the most difficult page that I had to write. And the problem goes like this. There's what I read, the, 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 the hunting, turkey hunting pages are amazing. They've got the most information you could ever imagine. Brilliant. And a lot more than I knew when I was a kid hunting turkeys. And um, the problem was what the people had written about turkey communication and hunting versus what I hear every day with my flock of turkeys. And, and sometimes they're dead on and then sometimes the words are just things just aren't matching um but so anyway real quick demonstrate this this is ancient that got the boys attention actually it's supposed to get the boys attention to come springtime Ooh, we're almost at spring here in florida so this, this doesn't have chalk on it, so it could sound better. And my and my turkey hunting buddies all say that your mouth calls better because it frees up a hand. So anyway, where I was going. First off, I want to say I'm so glad that I was terrible as a turkey hunter as a kid. Got some, but not as much, not considering how much effort I put into it. But that was a kind of a Midwest thing. I think one of the one of the ones I remember most is um, I was sitting there uh, on the ground, and this turkey I could hear the gobblers calling down in the um, in the Ozark down in the hollers, and I called them in, called them turkeys, just calling some hens in too. So um, turkey hunting's hard; it's difficult because there's their eyesight and hearing this <laughs> I get that the birds are all like the birds are like what is going on it's actually um, it's calling them in pretty good so what happened was this turkey hen there's many many days good stories the one I was going to talk about was this gobbler I called this gobbler and come close 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 and when they're real close, what I should have done was this. That was no chop. Just the slightest little clock called, here I am, Mr. Tom. Here you go. <laughs> you hear that? That's what, that's what you're doing. What I did, because I think that was the first time ever, I went <laughs> thinking I was going to get the final, get that Tom to come. It's well known the Toms will come running like crazy to you. But um, that was more of an alarm. What I did was a, more of an alarm rather than um, a romantic call. So here was the problem with this. What I found with the with the um, websites, turkey hunting websites, and I'm sure they're all, you know, I, they, they know they did a better job than I could ever do. But let's use a human word. Let's use the word "hey." You can say how many how many ways can you say "hey" that means a different word? You know, there's "hey," there's "hey." There's hey, there's a bale of hay. <laughs> when I practice, I had about another dozen more. The point being, it's the same word, different inflections. And so that was what's happening on the turkey website page, the hunting page, is they're saying, they're giving the same call a different word 
a different meaning depending on how uh, the inflection is. Um, there's worry, you know, the, the same the same noises could be um, could be a worry. Like whenever there's a whenever there's a um, eagles flying above us or buzzards, the, the, all the hens will go. That's a worry. Like we don't like that. They're not given an alarm to run, but they're given like, this is not good, this is not good, not good. Um, or, <laughs> they're all looking at me. Or, if there, a while ago, on the other talk, there was an um, eagle in the tree. And they all, let's see if I can do a lot they did, they went. Kind of, kind of. And it was basically, it was an alarm, hey, there's a bad guy in the tree bumps. And, then, and there, there's also variations. Sometimes if they see a raccoon or a dog, actually a dog, a stray dog in the yard will give us something too. But basically it's the same call, just done differently. And the, like my standard hunting call would have been, and then the, um, <laughs> it would have caused the boys to come running. The other thing that's so cool is, um, I probably can't do it here, it's the lost turkey call. And that's if you, if you, you know, the, they want you to spook spook the birds off the, off the roost in, at pre-dawn and then sit down and then do the lost turkey call, which is something like this. And it's just, it's just, where are you at? Where are you at? Remember that book, Who Am I? No, it's, where are you at? But what's cool about that is, I will hear variations of the, of that, where are you at, from babies, uh, day old, two old, two days old, three days old. Same exact call. Or even when the, when the young teenagers can't see their mother anymore, They'll be given that same. Sometimes it's a peep, 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 peep. But it's the version of the lost turkey call. Where are you? By the way, admission. I'm so glad I wasn't a very good turkey hunter <laughs> because the these guys are really cool. Let's see here. Let's see if I can do it. Beep, 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 beep. They're really cool animals, um, dinosaurs, and all that stuff. So, you can go to my um, uh, PetTurkeys.com. You can click on Turkey Calls or Turkey Talk. And for the most part, I have I have links to audio links to uh, other sites that you want to hear different calls. But um, that was my, my little talk on why what I watch every day versus what the what's what the hunters were writing was often didn't match. And it's almost always just because it's the same noise, they're just calling it something different. Hey, hey, hey. Like that. Hey. Hey. So the same way with turkey calls. They get tired of it. Anyway, I'm gonna put this I don't hunt anymore. All I do is take pictures. So I'm just going to put this back away for another century, maybe. All right. Hey, Bruce out. Hey, good chance? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Hey, if you get a chance, check out my uh, history book on Amazon, Freedom's Quest, or the sequel, End of Empire. Some um, Florida stories. Native Americans, with a, with a little bit of a turkey um, uh, inflection to the whole thing. Because, why not? Bruce out. Oh, I need chalk on this.